Okay, Isabella, it's time to go to ballet class. <coughs> Isabella, are you here? <coughs> oh, hey, Olivia. <coughs> I don't think I can make it today. I'm not feeling too well. Oh, no, you don't look well. I think I just need to rest. <coughs> Maybe I'll feel better after a nap. OK, but you've also got to keep your strength up. I know, I'll make you a smoothie. That'll help. Hmm, actually, that would be nice. Thanks, Olivia. <coughs> I'll be back as soon as I can. Uh, uh, I hope she's not contagious. Esme, Isabella is not feeling well. So, I thought I'd make her a smoothie. Oh, that's so kind of you. Could you make me one too? Actually, I was hoping you might share some of your grapes. grapes. Oh no, uh, these grapes are horrible. I don't want to eat it. Really, really bad. She would have worn these. That is But you're eating them right now. Uh, yes, I am. To save anyone else from eating them. Okay, Esme, I'll go and see if Liliana can help. <coughs> hey, Liliana, can you help me with something? Hey, Olivia, sorry, I'm a bit busy working on my new rainbow bean disco machine right now. Oh, cool. I just wondered if you had any fruit. Isabella's not feeling well. I'm afraid not. I did have some strawberries, but I used them to power the machine. They make the red bit in the rainbow. Uh, okay. Thanks anyway. Hey, it actually worked! Hi, Malice. <coughs> You do not look well. No, I'm fine. <coughs> it's Isabella who's not well. Do you have any fruit I can use to make a smoothie? No. The only food that I have here is Timothy's spider food. Wait, I could have given you Timothy's spider food and told you that it was some kind of special fruit. Oh, that would have been a brilliant prank. <sighs> okay, Malice, thanks. Feeling great. <coughs> I'm sorry, Isabella. I couldn't find any fruit. Oh, don't worry. After my nap, I'm feeling much better. Uh oh, I think I might have been contagious. <coughs> yeah, I think you might be right. Terrible! You must have caught it from me! Is there anything I can get you? Hmm... Maybe a smoothie? Oh, you poor thing! I brought you some medicine. I'll have it later. Oh, it's cold in here. Let me turn up the heating for you. There, you'll be feeling better in no time. See ya! Come on, Timothy, let's go to the beach. Oh, not again. Princesses tell me you're feeling ill. <coughs> it's 
really hot in here. I know. That was Isabella. Let's see what illness you have. <coughs> I knew it. Oh no, is it unicorn flu? <coughs> oh, stop it. I know that you're faking it, Malice. Ugh, I just didn't want to go cleaning. It's fine. I won't tell anybody. <gasps> Let's do something fun together. Let's go to the beach. Olivia, you should go back to bed. You don't look well. I'm fine. I think I'll go back to bed. This should have you feeling much better in time for school. Work. Liliana? I'll uh, see you after school. Liliana said you were sick, so I brought you some food. Mm, these are really nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, you really are sick. At least you won't have to do that test today. I'm sorry, Olivia. They're all gone somehow. I'll bring you some more after school. Oh. <coughs> What's all this groaning I can hear? Why are you all coming from different directions? If I can make myself ill, I won't have to take the test today. <laughs> Did you say something? Oh, nothing. You must be hearing things. Ah! <laughs> I know. You look terrible. Let me make you better. That's okay, Malice. I... So, how do you feel? <laughs> oh, sorry. I couldn't help myself. <laughs> Thank you so much, Malice. Oh no, now I'm sick instead. You better go before I make you sick all over again. I promise I'll come straight back from school to look after you. No school for me today. <coughs> That wasn't the best plan. A relaxing night in with my favourite fluffy slippers. Now I know they're cute but I don't care, they're comfy. <sighs> this is perfect. No interruptions, no worries, 
and definitely no. Malice, we need to pour some sugar, please. <sighs> Princesses. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, it's actually a cumber mask. Great choice. Thanks. Mm, I mean, oh, go away. I told you Malice wouldn't let us borrow some sugar. But Isabella, we have to believe in the kindness of strangers. The goodness that can be inside anyone. <laughs> Never mind, let's go. Good riddance. Now, where are we, Timothy? It won't open. What? But I have to do my bedtime skincare routine. It's stuck. Use some magic. Looks like we're here for the night. Ugh, what now? The door is broken. But the locksmith won't be open until tomorrow morning. Exactly. So it looks like... We're staying here tonight. I'm sorry, but we are. I'll have some hot cocoa, please. Isabella, I don't think we should be... With marshmallows. Stop, Malice will go... And a biscuit, please. OK, anything for you, Olivia? What? I don't have to like you to be a good host, but if this is a sleepover, it'll be done properly. Oh, OK. I'll take a cocoa too. Thanks. Red. R. E. D. Four. One, two, three, four. Do not trust your greatest enemy. <laughs> Darn, I knew I should have spent more time on my hair. My go. Blue. B L U E. Three. One, two, three. Sometimes things are traps. Weird. I wonder what it means. Mysterious. <sighs> okay, new game. How about truth or dare? Okay, I'll go first. Olivia, truth or dare? I'll pick. I dare you to give me your wands. Okay, sure. Now I dare you both to look outside. What? <gasps> this is a trap! We should have never trusted you, Matt! <laughs> Dream Timothy. Wasn't it? 